Witness the power of the dark gods. The realms belong to the pantheon by divine right. We seized them from your frail hands ages ago, and for all your vaunted strength, we hold them still. The weakling races will serve the great four, either willingly, or when we send your souls screaming to their domain. The Skeven are the greatest, best race. No, no fool it knows of our location, a place. We sneak hide better than even nasty git things. Only once we want to have our place, location known do we reveal, and then it is too, too late. The Skaven will rule all. That is our great destiny. Better that you beg, ask for mercy, and come give yourselves over to the greatest, best god, the Great Horned Rat. What's up, everyone? Welcome to another battle report for Saga Dice. We got Andy back again. Yep, I'm back. It's, it's been a little while. It has. It has. It's a hot day. It is. <laughs> it's warm. It's very warm. It's, it's, yeah. But we're playing some Age of Sigmar. It's going to be good. We're playing only the Worthy today. Yeah. I've got Skaven. Yeah. And I've got some Slaves Darkness. Yeah. And they're wearing all the armor. So it's going to be. It's going to be. It's going to be a long, hard day for them, I think. <laughs> yeah. We'll see. I've brought fewer models than you, I think, somehow. Uh, yeah, I guess. For Skaven, which is insane. But it should be really fun. Um, but. Before we go on to the, um, the list and such next, uh, if you want to support the channel, there's a Patreon. We've got a bunch of extra videos in there. We've got a whole nother campaign coming for Path to Glory and some other uh, normal battle reports at 2,000 points. Uh, but if you don't, that's totally cool. Um, we also, you know, you can also support the channel, but just by subscribing, liking, mm -hmm. commenting, doing all those other things that everyone else tells you what to do. Uh, but yeah, anyway, we'll be back in a moment with uh, the battle plan. Yes. All right, so we are playing only the worthy, and it's actually a pretty simple mission. Mm -hmm. um, we've got four objectives, and it's the usual score one, score two, score more. Uh, the only uh, difference is that uh, Galatian champions, if they were if they're within six inches of the objective, mm -hmm. um, then only Galatian champions can contest that objective. Um, okay. So in addition, no more than one Galatian champion from the same army can contest the same objective at the same time. Nice. Yeah. And you have two Galatian champions. Yes. These two little guys in the back. Yeah. And I've got one also in the back. Yeah. In the foliage. Yeah. Uh, cool. So, so if they do get up, up close, then you know maybe they'll be contesting, but I suspect we'll be keeping our <laughs> yeah. champions safe in the it back. It sounds like it. Yeah. Um, so yeah, uh, we'll be back uh, with uh, the army lists in just a moment. Yeah. All right, so I'm playing Slaves to Darkness, host of the Ever Chosen. And so for my general, I've got the, uh, the Chaos Sorcerer Lord there. Uh, and he is Mark of Chaos Slanesh. His command trait is Master of Magic for rerolls. And uh, he's got the spell from the Lore of the Damned, Chaotic Conduit. Cool. Uh, to get some rolls on Eye of the Gods. Uh, next to him is his uh, compatriot, Chaos Sorcerer Lord there, mm -hmm. uh, and uh, he has the Mark of Chaos Undivided. He's got the spell Demonic Speed, and I've given him Aspect of the Champion, Tunnel Master. Cool. Uh, and my last hero is in the back there, is the Demon Prince. And I know he looks like he's a corn Demon Prince, but he's actually <laughs> uh, Mark of Nurgle. Cool. Uh, yeah, that makes sense. Yes. If you're taking a Demon Prince now, right? Yeah. Yeah. So he's got wings and he's got an axe and he's got the Conqueror's Crown, which uh, stops enemy models with one or two wounds from contesting objectives. Nice. Uh, yeah, so then moving on uh, to the rest of my army, I've got... Uh, some Chaos Marauder Horsemen, uh, their Mark of Nurgle. They've got Javelins and Shields. I've got uh, two units of Chaos Warriors uh, okay. in the middle there. So uh, the unit that looks kind of more light 
reddish mm -hmm. or you know something like that. These fellers here. Those there. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So they're mark of Slanesh. Okay. And uh, they've got the banner of screaming flesh um, to give them the plus one attack on the charge. Cool. The other unit of 20 Chaos Warriors are the Nurgle Warriors. They've got the Eroding Icon banner. Um, and yeah, so that's pretty pretty stompy and uh, yeah. can soak up some damage. Uh, I've got five Chaos Knights, which are Mark of Corn with um, lances. Mm -hmm. I've got uh, 10 Chaos Marauders, which are Mark of Nurgle. Nice. Um, they've got shields. Yep. Um, <laughs> and then over on the other side, I've got three Varen Guard, and they are Mark of Nurgle as well. Cool. Um, just with the regular loadout for them, the ensorcelled weapons. Okay. So, yeah, so uh, the two units of Chaos Warriors are in the Galatian Veterans. Everything else is in a battle regiment, so I'm three drops. Nice. And I'm coming in at 1980 points. My grand strategy is take what's theirs, and I've got a Triumph, which is indomitable. Cool. We'll be back in just a moment with the Skaven list. Today I've brought 2,000 points on the nose of Skaven in a double battle regiment. Um, up first, we'll go with the uh, my, my general, Vermin Lord Deceiver, uh, Devious Adversary, as is popular. Also with the Shadow Magnet Trinket, which is also popular. Uh, he's got Flaming Weapon for his spell. And next to him we have Thankwell. Uh, obviously he's a named character, but he does have a Skitter Leap. And then we have the Hell Pit Abomination next to him with Toughened Sinews. And two units of Clan Rats. And a unit of Storm Fiends, they're back. I haven't brought them since the book originally came out. I think they're still way overpriced and blah -zy blah but um, it's been a while. And I wanted to bring like a super elite Skaven army, which I did. Oh yeah, and I've got um, an engineer. I wanted a bombardier, but I could only fit an engineer because it's 2,000 points on the nose. Um, he has more and more warp power, of course, and the tunnel master uh, aspect of the champion. So yeah, that's two, uh, two drops at, at 2,000 points, which means Andy will get the triumph. And yeah, we'll be back with whoever's going first in just a moment. All right, so we're into start of the game. So I'm getting turn one, and uh, for my battle tactic, I'm gonna do Desecrate Their Land, and I'm gonna pick this one right here in the middle that sort of straddles our territories. Yeah, so territory is split down the middle here, so yeah. Yeah. Desecrate's a little easier. Yeah. Cutting uh, maneuver becomes harder, but that becomes easier. Yeah. So then I'm going to, uh, for my uh, heroic action, uh, I'm going to pledge to the Dark Gods, so that'll give me three dice. Nice. For my, uh, I'll put that on my uh, general. And any two ones is uh, perils? Is that how it yes. works? Okay, yeah. cool. Um, so that's your start of phase stuff. I'm going to try and roll a CP on my general over here. Yep. Um, I need a four up, and I don't get it. Okay. Good talk. Okay. <laughs> uh, so then into hero phase. So before I forget, I'll do the oracular visions. Okay. Uh, so I'll put one uh, from this sorcerer lord on these chaos knights. That gives them plus one save, I think. Uh, no, it just gives them a six up ward. Oh, oh, right, right. Against uh, just regular wounds. Cool. Yeah, they have a five up ward against mortal wounds, but right. it gives them a six up ward against uh, regular wounds. And Everything. then the other one will put the same thing. Uh, but on the Varen guard there. Nice. From the other guy. Like it. Yeah. Um, so did it used to be plus one save? Did I make yes, that up? It did. Okay, yes, okay, cool, it did. cool. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So it was, yeah, which was pretty good. Yeah, pretty good, especially in the old edition. Yes, yeah. for sure. Even better, because that yeah. was rare. Um, cool, okay. Okay, so uh, I'll try to roll for uh, Mystic Shield. Nice. On the uh, my general there. The 3d6 guy? Yeah. Okay. Okay, so he's got double one. Oh he's my master, god. He's got Master Magic though. Wow, he does, right. <laughs> Good thing. Okay. Oh my so gosh, wow. He just about makes it on a six. He he gets it on a six? Mystic or he, Shield. Or he, oh right, oh, that's right, yeah. yeah. <laughs> okay, but that was a scary You said he just about makes it, so I thought that meant he didn't make it, and I was like, why doesn't he make it? I don't understand. Okay. Okay. Okay, you said these dice are hot, but 
Well, you know, you got to warm yes. them up a bit. Okay. Okay. Yeah. All right. <laughs> um, and then he'll... they normally are. I mean, if the if the dice fail you, I feel like it's your fault. Okay. Yeah. Fair enough. <laughs> um, and then I think the other guy will try to put demonic power. Okay. Um, I'm trying to decide which unit he'll put it on, but uh, let's put it on the. Right. Uh, no, I'm going to put it on the Baron God. Oh, okay. So that goes off on an eight. There you go. See. So it's a perfectly respectable demonic power. Casting amount. So they've got all the buffs happening. Nice, nice. Um, and that's it. So then we'll go into movement. Okay. We'll be back in just a moment. I moved everything up uh, here. So we've got the Chaos Warriors and Nurgle Warriors. The Knights just moved to within three of the terrain. They did. The Slanesh Warriors are up slightly and then big move forward with the marauders um and the vanguard so they're just kind of holding that point like and it. uh yeah so five points to me and we're gonna go over to rob's turn today i'm playing skaven and i'm playing a different list so hopefully this doesn't all go kaput but my first battle tactic is going to be desecrate over mia and it, my battle, or my heroic action is going to be uh, whatever the CP, make a CP on a four up on my general. Nope, doesn't get it again. All right, I will roll for one on my general. Nice. And nice. I got it. Nice. Everything's coming up Andy. Yeah. Okay, fine. Um, so now it is some spell casting shenanigans, as it were. Uh, first up is going to be Thankwell is going to try and cast. What's he trying to try and cast, Andy? He's going to try and cast Mystic Shield onto the Deceiver here. He is casting at plus four. Uh, so he does get it. So four plus four is eight. Would okay. You, would you care to unbind? Uh, no. Okay. So he gets Mystic Shield. That is good. It's good news for everyone. Uh, and I'm going to try and cast um, regular Skitter Leap on my engineer back here. Um, this is 6 plus 4, which is 10. I'll let it go. Okay. So he's going to move over here. Wait a second. That's not going to work. I can't do that. Um, I can't do that because I needed... Shoot. Um, is it okay if I cast with him first? Yes. Okay. <laughs> so if you want, I'll re-roll that. Yeah. We can just say it didn't even happen. So, cause I need to cast more and more warp power on them first. Okay. Right? So he gets plus one to this. Uh, so that's eight. Okay. I think I'm in range to maybe get I one. will. I would be happy to measure that for you. I think he would be the closest guy. Uh, yeah, yeah, you are. I think, wait one second. Um, is it over him? Uh, yes, it's touching his base. Okay, so then you are barely in range, sir. Okay, all right, I will roll that, and I need an eight. You need to. You need a nine. I need a nine. Yeah. There is an eight I can re-roll with Master of Magic. Okay. Uh, no, Maybe you got it. Six. Okay, so more, more, more power. Do I have a token for that? I don't know. So I'm just going to put like a random token next to them, so I remember. Yeah. And what else do I need to remember, Andy? Oh yeah, so then now I'm gonna try and cast regular Skitter Leap on yeah. him. Uh, so that is a four plus four is eight. Yeah, which okay. is what I want to go through. Th yeah. Okay, so he's gonna go approximately over here. Yeah. Um, I'll measure it later. And then now it's uh, the Deceiver, and he's gonna try and class, cast Flaming Weapon. Uh, he gets an eight plus one is nine. Okay. Would you I'm, like to try I'm, I'm out of range. So, okay, yeah. so flaming weapon goes down, and now he's going to try and cast dreaded skitter leap on himself. Uh, that is a an eleven. Okay, I'm out of range. Oh, are you out of range for him? Yeah. Okay. Um, okay. Do you want to try and unbind it on on Thankwell? The the. I think I'm out of range on him too. I think from this guy back here. You couldn't be because he's close. Oh, I see. Well, we'll 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 check it out. I did move up, but um, I could try it. Uh, 30. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah okay. he's more than in range. Okay. So I, what did I get? I got an eight with him. Yes. Yeah. Uh, no, you got it. Okay. Um, so then I will teleport things around and we'll be back at the end of the movement phase. Great. 
Okay, it is the shooting phase, Andy. And I thought I only had one unit to shoot, but then I remembered I got, oh, actually, I guess, first of all, so the deceiver popped back there. Uh, this guy popped up here, barely in range to do his buffs and whatnot. I'm kind of worried because he's kind of close yeah. to the Marauders, but we'll see. Um, and then, um, what else do I have? Yeah, these guys moved up, uh, moved up. He rolled a five for his movement and they ran and they ran. So, so it's basically just gonna be some shooting and then maybe a charge from the deceiver, yep. depending on what happens. So he's gonna go first. Um, he's gonna shoot his Doomstar um, into this guy here. And how many shots is that? It's D6. D6. I'll, <laughs> so we're, uh, about, we're about to find out together, Andy. <laughs> okay, I won't do all our defense then. Yeah, I don't, because it's, it's D6. Yeah, so it might just be one attack. We'll see. I, I think you get to find out the attack's characteristic before you decide. Oh, okay. So, sure. Uh, it's only two. No, I won't do all Okay, yeah. <laughs> um, so the Doomstar is, oh shoot, I forgot to. Forgot to choose my target, Andy. Um, tell you what, because we didn't do this at the start of the game. Yeah. Uh, on a one, two, it's him. Three, four, five, six. Okay. Uh, it's that guy. Okay. So he is my uh, assassination target. I get plus one to hit and wound against him. Okay. Um, for both shooting and melee. Sure. Um, so now we got two attacks going into this fool here. Yep. Uh, so we're hitting on threes, wounding on threes. So threes, uh, that's two hits. And this is two mortal wounds and the attack sequence ends. So it's two mortal wounds and wounds on threes. Uh, so that's one at minus one. Okay, so this will save on a four. Does not save. So that's four total damage, which okay. you get a six up against. Right. And I made nice. one, got one. So take three damage. Okay, so he's down to seven wounds. Yeah. Okay then, I am going to fire my rattling guns into um, the Varengard here. Okay. And I'm going to fire my uh, wind launchers into that guy. Okay. So in this case, I will do all out defense on the deep. Before you do that, yes. the wind launchers are minus three rend. And they're the ones that are targeting him. Okay. Just, I, I don't, I just want to make sure that you understand that before you okay. uh, do that. Okay. And then the one, the ones on the variant guard are what rent? Minus one. One. Yeah. Minus one rent. Okay. Uh, and how many, like what's the, what's the... Uh, Attacks characteristic? Yeah. These guys are 3d6 each. So it's very random. And these guys are three each. Three each. Yeah. With the rent three. Yeah. Okay, I'll do, yeah, I'll do all our defense still on the Demon Prince. Okay, cool. Just wanted to make sure you knew what you are getting yourself into. Yeah. Okay, so I'll do the Rattling Guns first. Okay. Um, three, 3d6 attacks each going into them. Yeah. Oh, and I'm gonna Warp Spark. I rolled my Warp Spark off camera. I have five total and I'm using one to uh, buff their attacks. Uh, so we are 3d6 attacks. So that is 12, uh, 16, plus six is 22 attacks, Okay. right? Yeah. Okay, so that's six and four is 10, plus five, plus five, plus two. Okay, so because more and more work power went off, they are hitting on twos, wounding on twos. Okay. Into the Varengard, um, am I on camera? Yeah. Okay, so hitting on twos, there's another one in the middle. Yeah. yeah. Another one there. Yeah. Okay. There we go. We need all the help we can get, don't we, Andy? <laughs> <laughs> uh, so now we're wounding on twos. Uh, take out the one. There's got to be another one in there. Nope. Nope. Just a bunch of twos. Okay. So we got five, ten, fifteen, eighteen at minus one, two damage. Wow, That's yeah. Pretty, pretty good. Yeah, no, nope, I'm happy with that, Andy. <laughs> so the reason I didn't take them for so long is because they underperformed every time, and I, st I still okay. think they're, they're overpriced, but we'll see what happens. Okay, so I've got Mystic Shield, so I'm <clears throat> yep. back to my three up. Okay. 
and I'll just roll a bunch of these in a row. Sure. Is that there's, nine? That's the first bunch. Okay. And then... That's five plus three, so you need ten more? Ten more, yeah. ten more. Cool. Yeah. Okay, well, it looks like a very good roll. No kidding. Wait, uh, what did you need? Four? Three threes. So threes wound, or you, wait, you save on threes? Save on threes, yeah. Wow. So they're a two up save? Well, they've got Mystic Shield. They're on a three up base. Oh, they got, Shield. got it. I did not know that. Okay, so did you only, did only two of them go through? Yes. Wow, so that's four damage. And then and you have a six up. And I have a six up. Holy moly. Which I made none of those. Okay, okay. so it's a four damage. But that's still only, doesn't even kill a guy. Doesn't even kill a guy, no. Wow. Yikes. Okay. So now we're doing um, six shots into La Demon Prince, hitting on threes, wounding on twos. From uh, all, oh, let's see. Even with the plus one, wounding on twos, so that's three at minus three. Okay, so with all out defense, he's going to do a five up. Right. Okay, he made none of those. So it's 3d3 plus three damage. So four, five, plus three is eight damage. Okay, eight, uh, six up. So if you make two sixes, he's fine. Okay. Channel your sixes. Channel your inner sixes, Andy. You uh, made zero. Nope. You yeah. are a failure, and may <laughs> God have mercy on your soul. Um, so he's dead. He is dead. It did take both the Doomstar and um, yeah, and that. Man, I'm pretty disappointed in those in those guys. So now, oh right, and this guy has a shot too. I forgot. Uh, Warlock Engineer, three shots going into these guys. <clears throat> um, wait, no, he can't shoot them. I just realized I have to be outside a nine. Yeah. So, and he's got a nine in shot. So he gets to shoot nothing. Okay. Um, I think I might have to move my guy a bit. Yes. Because he's outside of, <clears throat> anyway. Um, so I guess charges? Yeah, I'll charge in with my deceiver. He needs a six because he's six inches away and he gets a seven. Okay. So I'll move him in and then we'll be back with the combat phase. Sure. Just a moment. Okay, it is the combat phase, but first we've got some monstrous rampages. I'm gonna try and roar him. I uh, get it? So he is roared. Okay. So it saves you a CP, Andy. Right. You're welcome. <laughs> um, so I am going to use a CP on my general though. Uh, he's going to do the Clan Eshin uh, one called uh, Lord of Assassins. Um, and it gives him plus one to hit and wound rolls. Okay. Uh, so it's six attacks. He has flaming weapons, so he's plus one damage for damage three. Hitting and wounding on twos. Twos. That's perfectly average. Wounding on twos, they all wound. So that is five at minus three. So I think they all go through. Yeah, and he's, he's and dead. he's dead because, yeah. yeah, that is only, it's a measly 15 damage, Andy. Um, would you care? I guess you probably want to pile in. Yeah, I'll pile in. Cool. Okay, so I've piled in the Chaos Warriors and um, so I've done all out attack. Would you like to, oh yeah, all out attack, sorry. You, yeah. You said <laughs> yeah. Okay. So I'll be hitting on twos, winning on threes. Okay, so there's one miss there, one miss there. I think that's it. I think that's it. Pretty good roll. Yeah. And then wounding. That might be on... average, I can't tell. <laughs> yeah. Okay, there's a two, there's a one, a few more ones, two, and a two. Okay, so that is five, ten. 15 at rend one. Wow. Okay, five, 10, 15 at rend one, which puts me back to my save of four up because he has Mystic Shield. Come on, I'm gonna roll it over here. So I'm looking for fours. Oof, okay. And there we go. And then looking for fives here. Well, my luck turned around there because it was not great at first. So four wounds on him. I'll give you a, a counter. There we go. So taking four wounds. Thank you, sir. 
Okay. And I think that's it. Yep. So it's going to be uh, one, two, not more. Yes. And I get my battle technique. Yeah. Because uh, I made sure my guy was with barely within three. And that's it. Yeah. So five to four. Five to four. And then I guess there's a roll off. Yeah. Uh, where are we rolling this? Okay. Sure. Right here? Yep. I got a five. You got a, I got a two, which means Andy gets to decide. Yeah, I'll think about it, but I'll, okay. I'll, I'll, yeah, we'll be right back. Cool. All right, so I won the roll off and I've decided to take the turn. Um, I'm gonna do eye for an eye mm -hmm. and obviously try to kill, kill some stuff. Yep. Um, <laughs> Always a good strategy yeah. in general. Yeah, uh, so for my heroic action, I'm gonna Try to roll for a CP on uh, my Chaos Social Lord, and he'll get it on a two plus. Okay. Um, he got it. He did get it. I am going to. Do, 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 do. I think I'm going to. Um, I think I'm going to roll for a CP on my general. Okay, over there. Uh, actually, I'm going to do it on Thankful. Yep. Uh, four up. He gets it. Ta-da! Got one. Okay, and then for my remaining stuff, I'll put the Oracular Visions on uh, these guys from the Chaos Sorcerer Lord. Nice. And then he'll try to put uh, Mystic Shield on them. Okay. So that goes off on a seven. It does. Uh, I'm gonna try and do Thankful for the block. And he gets a seven plus uh, three is ten. Okay. So he blocks it. All right. I and think like that's a turd. That's it for my turn then. So I'll just go straight into movement. Excellent. We're back. It's the end of the movement phase, but I forgot to mention that I did roll for this guy in between, and I rolled a four, so he did not take any wounds from using his warp spark. Um, Andy, why don't you tell us about your movement phase? Yeah, so I, on this side, they all kind of moved up, ready yep. to charge in. I sure did. Um, Chaos Sorcerer Lord just kind of shuffled up a little bit. Mm -hmm. uh, the Chaos Knights are up here. Uh, the Marauders ran here. Yep. And the Varen Guard um, moved up, ready for the charge as well. This is all correct. And you are going to shoot. Yes. With your shooting unit. Yeah, they're gonna throw javelins into some the Skaven. Some clan rats, yeah. yeah. So uh, hitting on fours. Hey, not bad. Wow, that's really good. And we I told you the dice are good. Yeah. Um, oh, nothing. Well, there you go. <laughs> was it wounding on fours? Uh, I think it was, yeah. So I was gonna like, if I could, uh, I thought Thankwell was the the warlord or whatever, where he's always the general in addition, but he's not, as it turns out. So I what I couldn't use his ones like his free CP, so I didn't end up all out defensing them for that reason. Yeah. Um, cool. Okay. So charges. Yeah. So let's start on this side. Yeah, for the important ones. Yeah. So the chaos um, warriors, right? Uh, Marauder horsemen. Oh, okay. So they got a ten. Ooh, baby. So I'll put that there. Cool. And then the chaos warriors. Oh my gosh! You got eleven. <laughs> These dice. Uh, the Chaos Knights, and they cool. get to. So be yeah. careful! Don't forget, I can unleash hell. Yes, I know. So I'll probably go with the knights. The knights first, okay? Yeah, because I will be unleashing hell. Spoiler alert. <laughs> so okay, so that's ten. We'll do it. So you you want to probably make sure that they're within three of of these guys. Yes, that's what that's what that's the plan. Yeah. Okay. And then the Varen God. Okay. So they go seven. So I have to shoot into, assuming you get these guys within three, I have to shoot into them. Yes. I'll get my dice ready and Andy will move guys in. We'll be right back. So these guys have charged in. Unleash Hell. Yeah. Uh, six dice from Spanky. Or not from, from, from this guy, these guys here. So we got six attacks, uh, sorry, eight, nine, 10, plus six is 16. Sorry, I just bumped him out of coherency. Um, so 16 attacks, so that's six there. And I just need to add 10 more dice. Five, two, is that right? Yes. Okay. So they are minus one to hit, but they are plus one to hit from more more warp power. I can't warp spark them because it's not the shooting phase. Yeah. So it is 
Uh, 16 attacks, hitting on threes, wounding on twos. Sorry about that. Uh, usually drop dice don't count, but I can't fish it out of there, so. Yep. <laughs> um, two, there we go. So we've got that many hits. And then, come on, there we go. Wounds on twos. Uh, it's a good thing, because that's a lot of twos. Uh, so we've got what, six, seven, eight, nine. Nine uh, at minus one on the knights. Okay, so they'll be saving on fours. Cool. So they Dang failed. It, oh, wow. <laughs> Just failed two. So two damage, so the six is for that. And then I'll do the... Um, uh, they don't have a six up save. I thought you gave it to them from the sorcerer? Oh, you no. gave it to them, didn't you? Yeah, so that'll okay. kill one knight. One so, knight, okay. And then one wound on a knight. Okay. So, so I'll, I'll, I'll just collect the wounds for now and then I'll... Okay. So, so four wounds total. Four wounds total, and then we've got the uh, wind launchers. They're minus one, plus one, so they're hitting... Sorry, they're hitting on fours. And that's perfectly average. And wounding on twos. Uh, so two at minus three. Okay, so saving on sixes. Cool. Nice. So, Shoot. And how so, much damage is that? Oh, D3. Yeah. Uh, two. Okay, so I've taken six total wounds. Okay. So I'm going to lose two knights. Okay. I'll take those off and then I'll finish my charges. Excellent. Uh, I charged in with the Varengard. Right. And, oh, yeah. and at the start of the combat phase, I activated his once per game Shadow Magnet Trinket to retreat the Vermin Lord out of combat. Right. Um, so he is out of combat. So n now we only have to worry about this sort of area. Yeah. Okay. So I'm all out attacking. Right. And you're all out defensing? I am. Okay. And so I'm hitting on twos. Okay. And then I'm wounding on threes. Another good roll, Selwood. <laughs> okay, so... That is Could five, be. 10, 11 at rend one. Okay, 11 at rend one. And they're two damage each. Holy mackerel, okay. So, f sorry, you said 11? Yeah. Okay. Uh, five, 11. So I'm saving on fours. Jeez, uh, I only got two. So two, four, six, eight, 10, 12. Uh, 14, 16 wounds. Wow. Okay. Jeez Louise. Uh, so that kills um, 12, right? Or sorry, these two guys is 12. Okay. And then I need another four, right? Yeah. Okay. Is that a bad move? I think that's a bad move, actually. Yeah, I'm going to, I'm not going to, even though these guys are, are the punchy guys. I'm gonna take them out. They are seven wounds each, because they have one extra wound, because they've yeah. got the special armor. And so that so that seven wounds, that's 14, so I need to put two wounds on another feller. And then I get their mounts. Uh, so these are threes and, does it be threes and threes? Okay. Holy heck, stop rolling so well, Andy. Oh, wow. <laughs> oh my god. So I said stop rolling that'd so That'd be well. seven at rend. Don't continue to roll well. Seven at rend, one, one damage each. Seven at rend, one. Uh, seven at rend, one. The horses have rend two, hey? No, one, just rend one. Yeah, but the horses have rend as well. Yes. Okay. Um, fours. Uh, well, there we go. I finally matched you. Are they one damage? Yeah. Okay. So he takes one damage. Boop. And um, so once they've uh, fought, uh -huh. the, I, they will be fighting for a second time. They can do this once per game. Okay. Uh, but now it's over to you. Well, and I'm, I'm gonna, I gotta go over here, right? Yeah. Um, so I'm gonna pile them in and I'll be right back. Yeah. It is uh, time for some clubbing blows. Uh, I'm gonna do two into them and two into them. So the first two going into the Varengard are hitting on threes, wounding on twos because of normal warp power. But minus one to wound. Right. So, so hitting on threes. Good lord. I'm dropping more dice than you and I'm rolling less dice, Andy. Um, wounding on, 
threes because of your th your power. Yeah. So that's three at no rend on the Baron Guard. Okay, so saving on threes. So one goes through. So it's two damage. Okay, so that'll kill one. And then put a wound on another guy. Thank the great horned rat. Um, now we got eight attacks going into corn corn holes. Uh, yep. Eight attacks hitting on. Are these guys minus? No. Nope. Okay, so hitting on threes. Uh, nice. Okay, there we go. Finally, the great horned rat has acknowledged me, wounding on twos. Um, by the way, wait. Before I, because there's a lot of twos there. There's four twos there, Andy. Before I remove those dice, are am I minus one to wound if I'm within range of them, or is it only against them? Only against them. Okay, okay. So then it is, in fact, one, two, three, four, five, six. Six at my, or minus nothing, but it's two damage each. Okay. So these, six dice. These are save on threes. So two go through, three, three go, go through. through. So it's uh, six total damage. Okay, so it'll kill two. Okay. That was pretty good overall. Yeah. Yeah. Overall. Um, I was hoping to do more against the Baron Guard specifically because yes. yeah, they're coming back and they're still plus one to hit. Yeah. Uh, but there's no point in going over here now. So I'll go over here. Yeah. yeah. Uh, so I'm, I get plus one attack because you were holding the objective. Yes, this is all true. So I'm going to get three times 20 is 60 attacks. Holy mackerel. Um, plus one for leader. So 61 attacks. 61 attacks. So yes. Christ on So right. five. Okay. And <laughs> 61 attacks. 15. And they're one damage each? Yeah. Okay. 20. I'll do them in 30s. Okay. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Okay, so this would be the first 30, and right. these would be threes and threes. I'm not going to all-out defense, because I only have one CP left, and I might need it for battle shock, yeah. assuming I survive, which is unlikely. But... Okay. Or actually, I'll, I'm going to use it on the Storm Fiends, assuming they survive. There's a two there. Thank you. Mm-hmm. And then they hit on threes now, huh? Yep. Wow. They always hit on threes. Oh, did they? Yeah. Do you still have a four up save? No, they've always had a three up save. Oh, okay. Yeah. Okay, so from the first batch, that is five, ten, thirteen. Thirteen, that's my number. I'm feeling lucky, guys. He just put thirteen attacks into my clan rat, so what could go wrong? Uh, is it minus one rend? Yeah. So I'm saving on sixes. Um, yeah. Drop dice do not count. Okay. So I save one. So 12 dead? 12 dead. And then I'll do the next roll. Okay. Roll a bunch of twos for me, Andy. Be a pal. Ah, you did pretty good. I appreciate that. There's still a one and a two there. So there one more two on the right there. Yep, that's it. No. Okay, and then threes. So 12 dead rats so far. Okay, so that's another uh, eight. Another 13. Uh -huh. What could go wrong? Wait a minute. <laughs> six, <laughs> five, six, one. So I need to make a lot of sixes here. Yep. Um, I make a good amount, but that's still enough to kill them all. Yeah. So they're all dead. You get your, um, you get your battle tactique. Yeah. For eye for an eye. Congratulations. Oh, by the way, he made sure that the hell pit was not in yes. range. Yeah. So then I'll go with that last chaos knight there. Right. Um, so he's got three attacks base, plus one being a leader. Oh, he's based. And then he's corn, uh, so he gets an extra attack. Mm -hmm. But the sad thing about these guys is they hit on fours. Okay. So he hit with two. Okay. And then they wound on threes. So two saves at Ren two. Uh, so they are saving on fives now. Yes. Saves one. So that's two damage. Two damage. Uh, so it takes this guy up to five taken. And then the trampling hooves on fours. It's two hits. And on fours again. 
One more save at no rent. Okay, threes. Saves it. Okay, and then I get to go with the two Varengard. This is true. Um, I mean, I can go with the with the clan rats, but... Oh, do you want to do that now? Sure. Yeah, go ahead. Um, I'll have to pile them in. But I mean, I think it's pretty safe to say I'll get four guys in. Yeah. Uh, let's say three. Okay. Uh, so fours. One hit. Fours. One wound. No rend. Clan rats. Same. Oh. <laughs> okay. I'm going to move them in. I'm just going to shuffle them over yeah, slightly. Sure. By the way, these guys are in coherency as long as the ends have uh, are base to base. Yeah. Because then they are because a uh, 25 millimeters is less than an inch, right? Just 25.4 millimeters. I always get a comment on every video where we, in which we have clan rats or Mortec guard or anything with 25 millimeters. So I'm yeah, gonna explain that. Not that I don't like the comments. I love the comments. Leave your comment. Let Andy know how good he's doing. All right. Tell so us what you think of the list. Okay, Varen Guard. Actually, don't tell me what you think of my Skaven list, because I already know, okay? <laughs> this is a fun game, people. Okay, on twos. Twos, wow, right. Because they're still all unattacked. Yes, and then threes. Okay. Lots of twos, Andy. Channel your twos. Not good enough, nope. but I'll take it. So five at Ren one. Ooh. So saving on fours. Hey-o! Uh, only saves one. Two, four, six, eight. Who do we appreciate? Not Varengard. Uh, eight. So that kills this guy off because he has one wound left and it kills off this guy and puts one wound on the final, or not the final, one of the two. And then the mounts will be Tearing Fang. So threes. Goodness. And then threes <laughs> again. So that's four at rend one. Four at rend one. Uh, so saves one, three go through. So it takes them up to four taken. Yeah. Uh, cool. Okay. Um, that's that. Mm -hmm. So you have one. I've got to roll battle shock for the, the knights. Right. And I'm going to spend a CP. Yeah. to uh, pass for my Storm Fiends, because okay. otherwise Here's they're all going to be gone. Here's the roll for the Knights. That's a two. Uh, Here's a two. I lost four, and the Bravery seven, so he stays. Nice. Wow. Okay. Nice. That makes sense to me. Uh, you can't fail here, and yeah. Okay. Yeah, yeah Varen got a Bravery nine, so yeah. This is correct. So, um, so you get five points again? Uh, yeah, eye for an eye, and I control them. Yeah, so five points again, so I'm up to ten. Okay, so that will be um, uh, ten to four for the Slaves to Darkness. We'll be back with Skaven, turn two, in just yep. a moment. It is uh, Skaven, turn two. Um, got some ground to make up here. Uh, lost some important stuff, but... I'm confident that we cannot do it. So my her no my my battle tactic is going to be eye for an eye, same as Andy, monkey see, monkey do, rat pee all over you, and then heroic action is going to be uh, heroic recovery on this guy down here. He's got a bravery of ten because he's a giant rat demon, so I need to roll equal to or less than that, which I do barely, which is a nine, so he recovers d three, four, and I get three, three. sweet. Would you mind marking his, him down to one yeah. wound Yeah, and I'll just quickly roll my, uh, I'm gonna try and generate a CP. Cool. On a two. I got it on a five. A fine choice, sir. So then I'll um, give you a wounds back. Excellent. Then I am going to do some spell slinging. Uh, up first is going to be, thank you Spanky, he's going to try and cast uh, Mystic Shield onto these guys. So I am plus three to this. Uh, so it's six plus three is nine. Would you try to? Would you care to try to dispel? Uh, no. Okay. So Mystic Shield. Um, I think you took the token back. Did I? Yeah. Oh, I did. Ha ha! Fooled by my own stupid stupidity. 
loves it. Um, so then we got Mystic Shield on them. I'm gonna do an Arcane Bolt. He probably zapped himself in the crotch. No, he didn't, so that's a nice 13. Um, and so he's got Arcane Bolt. I'll see if I can find it. There we go, Arcane Bolt. And then um, he's gonna try and do Flaming Weapon again. Yep. Uh, that is a nine. Would you like to try to? Yeah, I'll try to stop that. No, that is a nine as well. No. And so he gets flaming weapon. I'm going to toss that back over here. Don Shane, and then he's going to try and warp out of there. Uh, six will do it. Okay. Um, so he'll he'll warp in a minute, and then more more warp power from this fool over here. Uh, he gets a 10 because he's plus one next to the knot hole. Okay. Um, so uh, he puts more more power back on them. Oh, shoot, I forgot. Uh, at the start of my hero phase, they're supposed to take D3 mortal wounds. They take one. Ooh, oh my god. <laughs> I almost lost a guy. Um, more more power is back on them. And then I think that's it. Yep. Yeah. So we will be back at the end of the movement phase. Well, we're done moving. Uh, <laughs> so this guy ended up teleporting outside of six of this guy over here. And uh, these guys retreated. Thank you, moved up over here. These guys stayed, he tunnel mastered, and that's all my models. <laughs> so uh, first up is going to be uh, Spankule. And he has got his uh, flamethrower attack. Um, looks like he can get up to there. So two, four, oh, six. Sorry, eight, can you just 10, check the, yep. from the base, right? Yep, from the base. Yeah, that, that'll still get that guy. Okay. Maybe not that guy actually. Oh no. Oh wait, I moved it away. Oh yeah. Oh no, that's Nate. Okay. So you're right. So two, four, six, eight, ten, eleven. Eleven times four is forty-four. Okay. So. If my math is accurate, it means I should have actually gotten my dice ready ahead of time mm -hmm. and measured it ahead of time. So why don't we do 22 and 22? Yeah. Okay. Um, they have a five up against mortals, right? Yeah. So there we go. Okay. Maybe I'll roll it over here. So we're looking for fours here. He's got four flamethrowers. I think I told Andy, but maybe not <laughs> the nice people, but they'll probably see it on the screen. Um, okay, so, so far we've got, that was a good roll, 5, 10, 13 mortal wounds so far, Andy. That one just tipped over. Um, come here, you. And then, so 13 so far. And, uh, let's see, so 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23. Not as good the second time, but that's okay. 23 mortal wounds. Okay, so that was 13, and I gotta get 10 more. Yes, sir. Okay, so these save on fives. They do. So the first batch, and then the second Dang. batch. Okay. So, <laughs> Look at all those sixes. What the crap? Look at them all. <laughs> okay. I'm having fun counting your sixes. That was a six as well. I just turned it by a mistake. Okay, so that'll kill one, two, three, four, five, six and a half Chaos Warriors. Okay. Do you want me to pull them off for you? Uh, yeah, I can just pull these okay. six here. Sounds good. And then I think the, the Doom Star, these guys don't have anything against mortals, right? Uh, no. So I'm gonna put my Doom Star into them then. Um, so uh, it's just D6 attacks uh, for three. Um, and I think it's threes and threes. Where are you, Mr. Vermin Lord? Nope, that's the, there we go. Yep, threes and threes. Threes, and so it's two mortal wounds, and wounds on threes, and it's two at minus one. Okay, so they're on fives or sixes? So oh. it's six total damage. Oh, you don't okay. have, oh, I see, yeah. Yeah, so I'll just take off three. Okay. Uno, dos. Let's do these three here. Okay. And then, so that's those two done. And now we've just got the fun bit. Got some storm fiends. Yep. They're fiending for some blood um, in the storm because it's raining out. I don't know if you guys can tell. 
It's not raining. Uh, D6, three D6 attacks each. So 66, I'm going to warp spark them. And I'm gonna roll this on camera this time. So on a one, on a one, where is he? He takes uh, D3 mortal wounds. He takes it for two. So take that. He got too confident. He was feeling, I don't know why. Like the battle's not going his way, but he was overconfident. What can I say? So we've got 66 attacks essentially. So we got 11 plus three is 14, uh, 18, 22, 25 attacks. That's yeah. pretty good. Uh, 25. So five, five, five. Five and five, okay. And they do have more more power on them still. We're gonna put everything into the Varengard. Uh, would you like to all out defense? I don't have any CP. Oh, okay. I mean, I have one, but it's over here. Oh, I see, it's only on hand, got yeah. it. Okay, so then it is, <clears throat> it is uh, twos and twos. Whoosh. So we got, uh, oh, I just pull up the ones. Do you see any ones? No. Okay. Mm -hmm. Wounding also on twos. Oop. There we go. There are those ones I was missing. Uh, five, 10, 16. Okay. I had 18 the first time. So 16. these will be saving on fours. Okay. Okay, so I'll find the fails. There's a one there. I think okay, and there's two that. damage each? Yeah. Okay, so, so 12 damage? 12 damage that'll kill you. They're gone? Yeah. I thought they had a six up ward. Uh, oh, that was the last turn. Oh, wait, don't. No, no, they don't. Okay, okay. No. And because it's not mortals, they don't get a save against yeah. that. I see. Um, okay, that worked out better than I thought. Um, okay, so then. Uh, charges, right? Yeah. I've already got eye for an eye, so I'm actually gonna charge in here first with sure. the help it. Uh, <laughs> he doesn't make it. I can't re-roll. <sighs> I better re-roll. <laughs> okay then, <laughs> darn it. Your dastardly plan of being right outside of um, three inches. Three inches worked. I'm gonna try my luck with the Vermin Lord there. Uh, he does make it with a seven. Rawr. Okay. Um, so I'm going to stomp this feller here. Okay. I'm gonna try and stomp the uh, the Sorcerer Lord. So yep. two up. Uh, four. Uh, two mortal wounds. Okay. And the Hell Pit is gonna try and roar. He does not get it. Okay. He's a big fan of ones, that guy. Um, so we're gonna go into the combat phase. I am going to go with uh, my hell pit uh, first. Does he do anything on the charge? No, he does not. How great, how great for him. So uh, first up will be flaily, oh no, no, the avalanche of flesh because it, that way we can just calculate things as we go. Um, it's one attack for each model in range. So they are all in range. So he has got, um, how many are left? Two, four, six, eight, 10, 12, 14. So it's 14, uh, five, 10, and 14. So he does mortals on twos and he can reroll because he charged. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. He's really punchy until he takes wounds. Um, oh dear. Well, at least I can reroll. Look at all those ones, Andy. Okay. So that's however many that was. Five, uh, 10, 14. 14 mortal wounds. I believe you save on fives? Yeah. Do you want me to help? Okay. Well, it's a good amount of fives. One, two, three, four and a half. 
Uh, so I'll lose five more because there's already a guy there. And I can't all out attack because I don't have any CP. I spent them all on burgers and fries and the shake to go with that avalanche of flesh. Um, so now we got six attacks, hitting on threes. And you'd be, uh, you'd be minus one to wound. Oh, okay. Minus one to wound, so hitting on threes. Uh, deer. And then, yeah, minus one to wound. Fours. Oh god. Okay, so nothing. And now we've got six attacks, hitting on threes. <laughs> oh, dang. Okay. And wounding on fours still. Uh, nothing. He got nothing from that banner. And we're also rolling poorly. Damn. Okay. Uh, it is now your turn to choose something to go with, sir. Okay. Um, I may need to put the camera down because yep, I'll yep. probably... We, yeah, we can cut it and you can... Well, let me just look, look at this. So... You probably need to pile in anyway, so why don't we, why don't we just cut well, it? Well, I mean, maybe I'll go with the Chaos Knight first because okay. one of those guys is down. He's down to five. He's taken... He's got one wound left. Okay. So I'll go with the Chaos Knight first. Cool. So he's got four attacks, um, hitting on fours. Oh yeah. So two hit. Mm-hmm. And then wounding on threes. So that's two saves at round one. At round one puts them on fours. Saves them both. You got your horsey still. Yeah. So fours and then fours again. So two cool. at no rent. You're not supposed to have that many dice, Andy. You're supposed to have one dice. Um, sorry, what was that? <laughs> uh, two at no rent. Uh, two at no rent. So threes. He saves. Uh, he takes one, so one dies. Oof. Ugh. Okay. Um, so then I'm going to kill him. Uh, I mean, want? still roll it, but okay, just sure. in case you whiff. Yep. No problemo. So we got six attacks hitting on three. Oh no, he's hitting on twos because remember he has the, that was his target. Right. So, and then wounding on twos. Uh, so that's that many at minus three. Yeah, okay. Okay. And then, uh, and now it's whoever you want to fight next. Okay, uh, maybe I'll, yeah, I'll go with these Chaos Warriors here. Cool. So they, but they'll all get to fight. Yeah. Actually, and they'll pile, a, pile it in, in a way so they'll get more bodies on, more the, on the objective. More on the objective, yeah, that's fair. So. so let's do that. So there'll be one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine of them. I can't believe I had 12 attacks and zero wounds on that guy. Well, he did have all his mortal wounds though. He did do a lot of mortal wounds, but I had 12 attacks, Andy, and I got zero wounds through. You made zero saves on them because I, I just rolled and that banner, that's yeah. crazy. Okay, I'll grab some more dice in a second. So these hit on threes. Holy mackerel. I'm not complaining about my dice rolling. I'm just like incredulous. And then threes again. So that is four, eight, 11 at rend one. Okay, 11, which nine plus two is 11. So he has a four up save from tough and sinews. So that goes to a five up save. Um, so he saves those and then all of these go through. Where is it? So four, five, six, seven. Seven. Yep. The blessed number of Nurgle. So we got six and a one. Okay. And then I get to go, you get to go with the- I'll go with the Storm Fiend here. Yeah. Piles him in and he gets, uh, I think it's four attacks. This guy's corn, so I'm not minus. Okay. No. So hitting on threes and wounding on twos. Uh, so that's four at no rend. Okay, so on threes, uh, one goes through. Two damage. So he's still alive. Yep, he sure is. Okay. Um, and um, then for this piling, I'll, I'll need to just pause. Sure. Piled in the Chaos Warriors. Uh, so there's um, eight of them attacking, hitting on threes. Got the old cross arm stance with your camera in one hand. Yeah. 
Appreciate that. That's some fine camera work. There's a, there was a two there. Oh, thank you. Mm -hmm. And then threes again. Okay, that's pretty good. Holy crap. What do you mean pretty good? They're all hits, Andy. <laughs> okay, so that's 12 at rend one. <laughs> okay, 12 at rend one. And so that's nine, 12 at rend one. Uh, so he's saving on fives. And not the best roll, uh, but I'll take it. Six, eight, and that's one damage each. Yep. So and then he's got a five up ward, saves two of those. So we got six more damage. So I'll grab a, another dice. Right there, yeah. Yep. And just add a sixer on there. Cool. And now, mm, do you want to attack with them or? Do you want to leave them in case I... I'll leave them. Yeah. Yeah. Fair enough. Um, okay. So that is yeah. my turn. Well, so I'll use my tr my once per game Triumph Indomitable to okay. order past Battleshock with sure. the Chaos Warriors. Yep. That sounds good. Um, and then I'll have to roll for the Chaos Marauder Horsemen. Okay. I lost three of them and the Bravery five. Cool. And I rolled a one. Nice. So they're actually fine. Um, so I'll just take... That off. is surprising. Yeah. Um, and then I, so I get three points. Yes. Because you have that one, that one, and that one. Yes. And I only have mine. And you got your battle tactic. And I got my battle tactic. So a total of three points, taking me to seven to your 10. Yes. And now it's a roll off. It is. Okay. I got a five. I also got a five. So it's your choice, sir. Why don't you have a think and yeah. we'll come right back. Sure. I won the roll off, so I've elected to take turn three. Um, I'm going to do gain, gaining momentum. Okay. And I'm going to try to kill the um, the beast. Oh, there. you have to name which one you're going to kill? Yes. <laughs> Excuse me. Yep. Sorry, everyone. Um, I'm going to do best day ever on this guy. You don't get a heroic action because I've killed all your heroes. Yeah. Mwahaha. Joke was on me. Uh, so... So that's the end of your hair phase, I guess? Yeah. Okay, well. So we'll be back after movement. All right, so after some back and forth, um, I just, all he did was actually just retreat the knight. Right. Uh, over yeah. here. Um, and we're just gonna go into some shooting. So the Chaos Marauder Horsemen are gonna shoot at this monster here. Cool. Fours and fours. So one hit. Okay. And one wound at one rend one. One at rend one on the uh, help hit. Yes. Um, so that would be. Uh, he saves it. That's yeah. a six. Okay. <laughs> All right. So then we're into the combat phase. We've got monstrous actions. Cool. All right. Um, so I'm going to try and uh, roar. Yeah. He gets it. What do you know? They have been roared. And then over here, I will stomp. Okay. So two up, I get it. Four, huh. uh, three. Okay, which I save on fives. You sure do. So save what two What a those. jerk. <laughs> Come on, man. <laughs> Work with me, Andy. We're trying to make this battle report exciting, okay? <laughs> okay, so I can't do all on attack there, but I um, may as well. Right, so are you gonna go into him? Yes. Because he can retreat if you do that. Yeah, but if I don't go to him first as- Oh, then you're worried about not getting your battle tactic. Yes. Fair, okay. Yeah. That's fair. So there's uh, eight of them left. So it's gonna be 16 plus one is 17 attacks. Nice. Five, nine, 10, 14, 17. Cool. 17 attacks. Uh, threes and threes. Right because they have been roared. Roar. That made a huge difference. Whoa, no kidding, there's another two there. Those are the fails. Your dice finally abandoned you, Andy. Yeah. The dark gods are on my side, now they're probably not. Okay, so that's five at rend one. Holy moly. Five at rend one, you shay. Uh, saving on fives. Uh, he saves two, three go through. So he takes, uh, he's, or he's taken, 10 damage, six left. Um, is it my turn? Is that yeah. everything? Okay, so this guy's gonna retreat out. 
try to be less stupid lately. Um, it works sometimes, sometimes it doesn't. So it's your turn again. Uh, uh, do, you, do you want to pile the marauders? Yeah, I'll pile the, yeah, pile the marauders. Sure. While you're doing that, I'm going to figure out my attacks on my hell pit. So. Okay, okay. Actually, I, don't I think need to do anything to two it. within an inch. Okay. So they are. Um, yeah, just pretty much fours and fours. Okay. So one, one hit. One hit! And. Nothing. All I hear is the laughter mm -hmm. of dark gods. Okay, so then he, there's two, four, six, Wait, two, eight. four, six, eight, nine. Oh, is yeah. it nine? Yeah, I think so. Oh, okay, I need to roll some oh, okay. dice. Is Do that, it. Okay. Yeah, of course. Yeah, so okay. threes. <laughs> so one more hit and one more save for him. Fives. He saves it. Okay. Um, so that so it was nine guys. Three. I was wondering why you were like so you're carrying so much whether it was eight or nine guys. Yeah. Uh, so he he's down to his worst bracket, Avalanche of Flesh. Oh no, he's not. He's on to his second worst bracket. So now it's doing mortals on fours. And I don't get to reroll because I didn't make a charge. So that's only four mortal wounds this time. Okay, so saving on fives. Okay. Uh, so three go through. Okay. And then, so six attacks. Um, I'm going to all out attack. Okay. Uh, so six attacks, hitting on twos, wounding on, are they Nurgle? Yeah. So wounding on fours. Okay. So twos and fours. Uh, so that is two at minus uh, two rend. Okay, so minus two goes to minus one because of my banner. Okay. So then save on fours. Both go through. Uh, they're just two damage each. Okay. And now four attacks from the flailing fists, uh, hitting on twos, wounding on fours because of the banner. Get out of here, one. Fours. Two at minus one. Okay, so back to my threes. Ugh. Oh so my safe. gosh. Those were gonna be three damage each. See what I mean though? Like there's no point in retreating from him. Yeah. He's a big turd burglar. Um, okay. Then, get that guy. Oh, okay, sure. So four attacks, hitting on uh, threes because of moral war power, wounding on, what are they? Minus one to wound. Okay, so wounding on threes because it's plus one, minus one. Um, okay, just one. No rend. No rend, so saving on a five. Because they have shields. No. Uh, two damage. Okay. And I think that's it. Yeah. <clears throat> um, you won't get your battle tactic, I think? No. Okay. But uh, you will have... One, two more. One, two more. So three points. And I got to roll battle shock. I'm just trying to decide. So the Chaos Warriors lost three and Bravery eight. I'll roll that one, I guess. Okay. So I'm good. Okay. And then the Chaos Marauders lost two. They are bravery six. So they're good. Okay. So then that is that. I guess it's going to be my turn coming up. Yeah. So I'll go up to 13 points. Okay. Versus your seven. Okay. Yeah. Uh, we'll be back with Skaven turn three. It is Skaven turn three. I am also going to cunning maneuver. Gaining momentum. Gaining momentum. Stand corrected. Um, so I got a CP and my heroic action. I didn't pick a heroic action, did I, Andy? It is going to be a, um, a CP. No, it's going to be, yeah, it's going to be a CP on him. Okay. He does not get it. Okay. Or he does get it. Sorry, that, that's his. <laughs> that's his. And then that rolled off of this guy. So that, that dice was up there to remind me to heal him D3, because he does that. So he heals one, so he's taken only a measly nine damage. Okay. I laugh at your nine damage. No, it's not true. I'm, I'm afraid. So now I guess it's spell. Wait, well, have you... I'll do uh, a rally. Oh, right. On right. the knights. Cool. So I get these on fives. 
right. Terrifying. So I get two back. Uh, that's that's a four. Oh, it's sorry. It's got like a little chunk in it. Oh, so you get one back, but okay. yeah. <clears throat> um, banner guy. Sure. Yeah, that makes sense. Okay. So then, uh, yeah, uh, spell casting time. Um, Spanky's gonna try and do an arcane, no, he's gonna try and do Mystic Shield on himself first. Uh, that does go off with a seven. So he gets that, I assume. So then, and then he's gonna try and do an arcane bolt. Uh, he gets that. So put that down. Oh, and by the way, I did, Remember to release my arcane bolt uh, yeah. in between, and he took a wound, and it killed one extra chaos warrior. Yeah. Um, so then, what else am I doing? Oh yeah, uh, this guy's gonna try to do more more warp power. Um, so he does not get it. Uh, wait, it's plus one. He still doesn't get it. So I'm gonna spend a warp spark, and I'm gonna see, immediately roll to see if he takes damage. He does not. So uh, now he's gonna try again. Uh, he gets even worse, but he doesn't hurt himself. So no more warp power for them. That sucks. Um, then uh, flaming weapon on this jerk. Uh, he gets it with an eight. Uh, so flaming weapon goes on him. And then is he going to skitter leap? Yeah, he's going to skitter leap. Uh, he gets it. Seven. So he's going to pop over here somewhere. Yeah. Yeah. Oh man, I'm so dumb. I should have tried to heroic recovery him. Oh well. Says la vie's as they say. Um, yeah, I think that's my uh, hero phase. Okay, back off the movement phase. Indeed. We are into the shooting phase. Spanky moved over here. Um, the clan rats ran and got that many guys on there. Um, and then he teleported in between over there and then to save everyone time, <laughs> I, re I rolled this ahead of time and I got 11 attacks on that guy. Yeah. So, which is perfectly average on 3d6. So, um, but I'm gonna go with Thankful first because I got all the dice ready. There's five guys, which means there's 20 attacks. Fours are mortal wounds. Um, not great, Spanky. Not great. Sheesh. You turd. Okay, so we got seven mortal wounds. Seven mortal wounds on the Chaos Warriors. Okay, so saving on fives. So I made none of those. Okay. So I'll lose I one, appreciate you helping two, me out like three that. Three and a half. Three and a half guys. Okay. Three and a half men. They're a big fan of the uh, sitcom with... Um, I don't think I've seen it. Uh, I, I haven't either, actually. That's why I can't even come up with his name. Uh, anyway. Uh, <laughs> uh, so now we're going to go with this. This lone feller over here, I'm going to spend a uh, all-out attack from this guy here, and a warp spark, which I'm going to roll for immediately. And he does not kill himself. Excellent. So he's hitting on threes, wounding on threes. So is here good? Or actually, I'll do it over here. Yep. Threes. There we go. Oh, wait, no, he's hitting on two. Oh, shoot. There was one two there, right? Yeah, those were all ones. Okay, so he's hitting on twos because it's the it's not the um, the other thing. Wounding on threes though because we did not get more and more warp power off. Oh, that reminds me, he's got to take D three mortal wounds. Uh, he takes two. Um, okay, so sorry, that is uh, on the Marauders. That is four, five, six at minus one. Okay, so on sixes. Cool. So I made one and then two damage each. Yes, sir. So they'd be dead. Okay. A fine choice. Um, and then last and uh, hopefully not least is the this guy here. Yeah. He's going to try and throw his Doom Star at these fellers here uh, for D6 attacks. Only two attacks, as usual. Uh, hitting on threes. Uh, wounding also. Uh, is it threes or twos? The Doom Star, I think it's threes and threes, which means he got nothing. Uh, oops, here he is. Doom Star is threes and threes, so I got nothing on that. That's fine. Um, so first up is going to be um, him. He's gonna yep. charge in, and he will not make it, which means I'm gonna reuse a, a valuable CP to re-roll that. Yeah. Uh, doesn't make it, great. <laughs> Excellent. Um, 
Fine then. I will, um, well, first of all, I'm gonna charge uh, Spanky in over here. Yeah. So he is going to get six, which is more than enough, which is exactly what I needed on him. And I think I might charge, I'm gonna actually charge him into them. Yeah. Uh, a five should do it. Yeah. Boop. Um, and he is going to go first. Ooh. Yeah, he's gonna go first. Sure. Yeah. Uh, so four attacks. Um, should I all attack? I'm gonna all, uh, no. Yeah, I'm gonna, nope. Oh, right, we've got monstrous actions. Yeah. So uh, he's going to roar the chaos warriors and he gets it with a six and Thankwell's going to stomp, wait. He's taken two wounds. Yeah. Oh, he just doesn't have, a, he's not a monster. So he's gonna stomp the Marauder yep. killers. Uh, four, uh, one mortal wound. Okay. And then, who am I going with first? I think I'm gonna go with, actually, I'm gonna go with that guy first. Sure. Because I just don't think that they can kill him. And then they've got Thankful right there. Ooh, no, that's a bad idea. That's a bad idea. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna go with, I'm gonna go with him. Kay. Okay, so it's uh, two attacks. And he gets to reroll. No, he doesn't get to reroll because he didn't make a charge. So uh, he doesn't get any mortal wounds. <laughs> and then um, Thankful's going to make him all out attack. And so we've got. Um, what do we got, Andy? We got six attacks hitting on twos. So they all hit. Okay, minus with, one to wound. Indeed. So fours. Uh, so that is three at uh, minus two. So it goes to minus one. It so does. Fours. So two go through. So they are two damage each. Okay, so they'll kill the unit. Okay. And then, so the rest of his attacks are wasted. It is your activation. I'm assuming you're going over here. Yep, I'll go over the knights. Cool. So two chaos knights. Yes, so one sir. has uh, four attacks. The other one has three Oh, sorry, attacks. I'm going to all out defense him. I meant to spend Thankwells over here, so I'm going to spend it for my general. Okay. Yeah. Why would I spend in here? You know what I'm saying? Okay. So he's all out defensed. Okay. We'll so see if that fours. Doesn't. Okay. And then threes. So that is uh, four at rend one. Four at rend one, putting back to fours. Uh, he saves two to go through. And then the mounts go... Are they one damage each? Yeah. Okay. Because they didn't make a charge? Right. Okay. Fours and four. Oh, those are three. And fours again. Cool. So one more save at no rend. And he does not save it. So he's taken... Uh, he's got one wound left. Okay. So I, I guess I might as well go with Thankful because he hasn't... Yep. The, the Marauders, uh, Marauder Horsemen, rather, have yep. not gone. So two attacks with Staff of the Horned Rat uh, hitting on fours. They both hit. Minus one to wound. Uh, so fours. Uh, so one at minus one. So saving on a six. Cool. Saved. Dang. Okay. And then Crushing Blows. He has six attacks with Crushing Blows uh, hitting on fours. Uh, so that is four, and then minus one to wound, puts him on fours again. So that is two at minus one. Okay, so on sixes, both go through? Two damage each. Okay, so they're dead. Okay. And then these guys have gone already, so I'll attack with him next. Uh, four attacks, hitting on uh, fours, and wounding on minus one. Oh no, it's not minus one. No. Okay, so wounding on threes now. Uh, one at minus one. Okay, so on a four up. That will go through. Two damage. So that'll kill that one. Put a wound on the other guy. Okay. And then, so that is, that's my turn. Yeah. So I'll get, I'll finally get five points here. Yeah. <laughs> one, two more, plus gaining momentum after I killed the Marauders there. Yeah. Uh, taking me up to a total of... Uh, Twelve. Twelve to your 13. 13, and then it's a roll off, right? Yeah. Okay. 
I got uh, a four. I also got a four, so you get the choice, sir. Yeah, although I mean, I think at this point, I've only got, let me see. It's hard for you to not, to capture three objectives from now on, isn't it? It is, yeah. Um, I mean, I'm just trying to think what I could do. I mean. Well, why don't you have a thing? I'll have a thing. Yeah. 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 All right, so going into turn four, I won the roll off, but I think I'm gonna call it. Um, I've only really got two units on the board. Um, you only have two units on the board. I only board. have two units yeah. on the board. <laughs> and as much as I, I definitely can kill the clan rats. You can kill the clan rats and you can kill this guy with only one wound left. Um, Possibly, yeah. Yeah, fair enough. Um, but then it leaves, Andy was kind of talking about how it leaves these two guys to yes. come over and murder them, and then he can just murder them, and then it's, yeah, yeah it's it's not really, yeah, because with, with all of uh, Thankful's flamethrowers. By the way, I ended up watching Coach's recent talk with, I think his name was Kieran, mm. uh, uh, about Skaven, and that's what actually, um, made me take the four flamethrowers today. So shout outs to Coach as usual, he does great stuff. But but yeah, and I guess at the end of the day, you you just feel like there's no way to yeah. secure. Yeah, I mean, if I had been able to bring down one of your heavy hitters, um, maybe then I would keep keep going, but I don't think. Right. Uh, yeah. Yeah, because like, even if you, if, you, if you come in and kill these clan rats, and even if you kill him, then you're still only got two objectives. Yeah. And then, yeah. yeah. And then I just kind of swarm over. And then if you stay there, and even if you kill him, yeah. then you've only got one objective. So yeah. that's even worse. Yeah. yeah. I think it, yeah, I understand. Yeah. Um, but thanks for coming on, Andy. It was yep. really fun to have you as yep. usual. You're not playing your main army. You brought your, your like third, third rank pick, army yeah. and, yeah. you know, yeah. trying to test out something different that we yeah. haven't seen on the channel before. So I appreciate that very much. So big shout outs to Andy for making time. And thanks to everyone for watching. And we'll see you guys next time.